Today I'm looking forward to sharing how I gave my plain white clawfoot tub a dramatic and unique transformation with the help of Maison Blanche. This has been the most enjoyable makeover I've done in a long time, and I can't wait to show you how easy it is to recreate this look. Last week I used an aging solution to give my brass tub hardware a bronze patina. And today I'm finishing this makeover by showing you the steps I took to give it some personality with specialty paints. The look for this bathroom will be a mix of rustic and vintage while still keeping the simple cottage style, so I planned my color scheme with those parameters in mind. I wanted the space to feel warm and earthy, so I selected a handful of beige and gray shades from Maison Blanche's vintage furniture paint and French lime paint lines, along with a few different colored waxes. I've used these paints before on another clawfoot tub with amazing results, and I couldn't wait to test out some new colors and products. Option number one was cobblestone, which I'd describe as a deep, neutral khaki. Option two is hurricane, a slightly darker and cooler shade. Next up was Franciscan gray, which is a true medium gray. Finally, we had coquille, which is a soft gray lime paint. Because I wanted to stick with warmer colors, cobblestone was the winner. This paint has a unique formula that makes it perfect for furniture projects like this. And since it's water-based, it's super easy to clean up. It adheres to almost any surface with no prep work involved. And the chalk-based texture leaves a rich, velvety smooth finish. The dimensional quality is especially ideal if you're going for an aged look, as it's great for sanding and layering colors and waxes. There was no sanding needed for this project though. I just gave the tub a couple of coats and waited for it to dry. While the tub was drying, I turned my attention to the feet. I love the look of black feet on clawfoot tubs, but I wanted to take this one step further with a bronze effect. I started by giving the metal a coat of Maison Blanche's wrought iron, which dries a soft charcoal black. After two coats were applied and the paint was dry, I grabbed my jar of organza. Organza is a thick, shimmery gel cream that will give any surface the appearance of metal. It comes in several colors, and I chose oil rub bronze, which works great over a black surface. To apply, I used a small brush and dabbed it into the gel. Then I lightly coated my surface, making sure to leave some of the black showing through for a more realistic metal look. If you apply too much, you can gently buff it away with a soft cloth. Or you can go back and add more for a stronger effect. In just a few minutes, my white cast iron feet became antique bronze beauties. To finish it all off, I tested out a few different waxes to seal and protect the paint. The amber colored wax didn't change the color much, it just provided a slightly richer finish. The dark brown wax deepened the color a bit and made the tub's texture more apparent. A thin coat of the white lime wax also blended into the surface and lightened it. I prefer the darker finish, so I went with a dark brown wax. Just like the paints, the waxes are buildable, so you can layer on as much as you want to enhance the effect. I didn't want it to look too brown, so I applied two super thin coats. There was no waiting, buffing, and reapplying process, so both the organza and waxing steps were completed in no time. I love working with Maison Blanche products because they're so forgiving. You really can't mess it up, and the paint isn't gonna chip and peel like regular latex paint. With these, you can experiment and be as creative as you want. I'll be using them on the bathroom vanity next, so make sure to check back and follow this bathroom's progress. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, or you can head to my blog for more details on this project. I've got a lot more furniture makeovers on the way, so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more.